hey you guys it's sunshine vibes with the high vibrations if you are new to my channel thank you for watching if you are returning thank you for subscribing to your girl love and light to you all i hope everybody is doing good so i'm gonna tap into these messages and see what i have for you all today okay so i'm being called Okay, call on my eyes right up. Second Archangel Michael. I ask that you be with me as I channel these messages. Give me clear and accurate messages for my colors. What do they need to know as far as the current energy? We have a powerful energy shift. So yeah, you guys are going through some type of major powerful energy shift at this time here. Um it's time for you guys to take a treat. A tempting offer has a high price. The natural world needs you. So, I feel like you guys, somebody is trying to invade some type of protection that you have. So, you guys are heavily protected her, I'm her. So, somebody's trying to invade your privacy, okay? I feel like this is somebody who is, like, trying to get some type of information from you. But that is some type of powerful energy shift that is happening at this time. Give me one, one part. Clarify this energy. Yeah, okay, so you guys are breaking some type of generational curse here. You're being called to express yourself. So, yeah, backfire magic, you was the one. So you a light worker here. Somebody was trying to invade your space. Uh-uh, don't get that. <laughs> okay, somebody was trying to invade your space here because you're breaking generational curses. And there's some type of powerful uh, energy shift that's going on in your energy. So you could feel tired maybe okay but this is because there's some type of like cycles being in and out of your energy i feel like you have a lot of people that are being closed out of your energy because you guys are breaking some type of generational curse clarify give me one for it yeah despair and reverse i feel like you are not in despair you're being called to express yourself i feel like you have a lot of people that is in your energy that want you to be feeling some type of way but in all reality i feel like spirit just wants you to understand that you know your time, the time has come. I'm her this song. Ready or not, here I come. You can't hide. I'm gonna find you and make you. But yeah, I feel like somebody is like, wait, somebody could be playing hide and seek. Okay, somebody could be hiding right now. <laughs> Somebody's acting very childish, but I feel like, you know, you know, there's something about your energy. Like, somebody's coming for you, right? You could be feeling this. Yeah, crystal clear vision. You have a, a clear vision of what's going on. I feel like this is why you're not in despair. You need one for it. So, we have, it's, it's card keeps coming out, you guys. King, divine masculine. There is a divine masculine here that is going through some type of karmic relationship, Okay releasing the past okay so somebody could be releasing the past this is why you are somebody wants to take the pathway to true love right and i feel like this is where the generational curse is coming from okay so i'm picking up on an energy like somebody could grew up real traditional when it comes to like the home family dynamic um you know some people just stay with people um somebody wanted somebody to stay Stay with someone, okay? Somebody was, like, trying to force their hand because now that I'm getting the download about the song, somebody is, like, trying to find somebody. I'm going to make you love me. So, somebody is trying to make a masculine love them. And, like, somebody needs to understand this is a karmic relationship. This masculine is, like, coming to his senses about this karmic relationship, maybe, because maybe somebody is just, like, feeling like, you know, somebody is trying to put some type of burden on someone and somebody's releasing this okay somebody's releasing this and this is why you're going through some type of powerful personal growth her it's some type of energy shift because you're breaking some type of generational curse here yeah third will enemy so this person wants to dis disrupt somebody's peace okay somebody's really scared okay that somebody is going towards their destiny yeah merge and reverse saving and reverse this could be somebody that you released her 
this person was not focused on their finances. Like somebody's like, I don't know what I'm gonna do without somebody, okay? If somebody withdrew from someone, somebody is stressed out, they're very scared, they have an anxiety, okay? Because they cannot take something from someone. Yeah, we have family here. Gift and evidence. So yeah, this person could be trying to get some type of evidence here. Okay, when it comes to some type of guilt here that you are receiving. Like I said, there is people in your energy that are in despair because they really are trying to be in your energy. I'm getting like a succubus energy. Okay, so I feel like these people know that you are an introvert. Okay, and they was trying to disturb something in your energy, but you're, you're protected. You can have family that needs your help. Like I said, this person really needs your help. Okay, and this this masculine could be ending something out and releasing something. And somebody expected somebody to be in despair when it comes to finances. Um, somebody could actually be suffering from financial loss here for wearing a mask. Okay, when it comes to protesting against you. Yeah, I don't feel like... I feel like somebody feels like something was not a good idea because they thought maybe if they did something that you would help them and you're not helping them. Yeah, trumpet, you're still winning. Somebody's getting evidence that you're still winning and this is bothering somebody, okay? Somebody really wants to apologize because they didn't want to listen here. Yeah, somebody's going through a lot of conflict. It's, it's, it's very hard for somebody to release this karmic relationship because somebody is like literally, I'm gonna find you. And make you want me. Ready or not, here I come. You can't hide. Yeah, and somebody's like, no, I'm okay. I'm stable. I don't I don't need to. I don't want to be around you. Yeah, you're going through a natural disaster. Somebody's telling somebody, like, I don't want to be with you. I don't want to. I want to. I don't want to be in this contract with you. I want to end something here. Why is conflict here? Yeah, because somebody cares about someone. Somebody's getting evidence that somebody cares about someone. They want to give somebody a gift. And somebody else is going through a natural disaster because of this. Yeah, commitment in reverse. Somebody cannot bind somebody to some type of merge. Or, yeah, somebody is mad because they can't keep someone stuck in an illusion. Okay, somebody's actually being coached to go a different way. Okay, they're getting some type of advice when it comes to their alliances. So, you know... But they are trying to stress them out. So somebody is letting go of some type of karmic relationship that is like a curse. Yeah, apology. Somebody wants to go towards somebody that they really care about. They really see themselves with. Okay, they love her. Um, yeah, and somebody's very stubborn. They don't want to hurt this. 777. Somebody was getting divine guidance to stop doing something. Okay, but somebody didn't want to hurt it. When it came to some type of investment, it was not a good idea because something is not going as planned here. Somebody is still winning. They're getting the evidence that they can't dominate someone here. Yeah, accident in reverse. I feel like Spirit is saying that this was not an accident, okay? Somebody wanted you in despair and it's reversing, okay? We have luck and in eternal love. So somebody feels like, you know, they are very lucky. So you could be running into some good fortune, okay? And you could be receiving some type of soulmate her and somebody could be like going through property like i said somebody is furious right now somebody is furious because somebody is moving on yeah somebody can't dominate somebody i feel like somebody in this energy they're used to dominate this this karmic uh masculine like i said somebody with that song i'm just keep hearing this song like and then now i'm seeing that uh now i'm seeing that uh video when uh she blew up the car. Like, somebody wants to, I bust the windows at your car. Yeah, somebody wants to do something to make somebody stay. Like, <laughs> somebody is trying to make somebody stay. Yeah, because somebody's worried. They worried about these illusions here, and they see somebody about to get a promise here. Okay, somebody was not being responsible when it comes to some type of bullying Okay, somebody was invested in the wrong thing. This is why they are not reaching their goals. So, yeah, I feel like this masculine is realizing, like, hey, I feel like you're on this other side because you're worried because you did some type of ritual on somebody. And somebody knows this. Somebody is, somebody is mad because somebody knows this. And this is why somebody's energy is being shifted. This is why somebody is breaking the curse because somebody is learning to express themselves. They're like, no, that's speaking up. They're like, no, you know what? I can't do it. It's like, I can't do this no more. Somebody's really like, I can't do it. Just leave, let me go. Yeah, sweetheart in reverse. This person, there's nothing sweet. This person's very bitter. This is why they're not reaching their goals. 
okay? Because somebody was so worried about trapping somebody, finding somebody. Now it's like they was not focused on the future, okay? And and, and it doesn't even have to be in that sense. It's like it's I'm giving I'm getting picking up on the energy like get up off of that thing, <laughs> okay? So. James Brown, what? Okay, so somebody to get up off of their ass. Somebody's a lazy motherfucker, too. Yeah, natural disaster. <laughs> natural disaster. This person was taking risk here when it comes to finding somebody, trying to find somebody. Okay, yeah, confinement. Because somebody's in, like, spiritual jail or somebody is very cursed. Okay, we have friendship and curse and overload. So, so, so this friend could be overloaded because this person could be using somebody's friend. To curse them okay because somebody wants you to stop so they can dominate you somebody just like stop okay they don't just like stop let me do what i usually do okay somebody's like let me do what i usually do and and i feel like something usually works on somebody okay when it comes to some type of merge somebody's trying to force their hands for somebody to stay I'm seeing people arguing a lot. So there's a lot of conflict going on behind this person. Not This person is seeing someone true colors. And I'm hearing when somebody shows you their true colors, believe them. Don't let people keep giving you, don't keep giving people chance after chance after chance. Okay, God give chances. Okay, this person needs, you need to release this person. Okay. And I'm hearing if it ain't broke, then don't fix it. But if something's broken, it's time to let it go. It's time to move on for her. Yeah, fright somebody's scared because they know it's time to move on. They know it's time to move on. They're scared. They're frightened. Okay, stress in reverse. You're not stressed here. Somebody's stressed about finances. Okay, they're stressed. They want something to stop. They really don't like the fact that you are moving forward, whoever you are. Yeah, they want to curse you. This is definitely a friend. Somebody could be using a friend to curse you. Okay, somebody wants you to feel overloaded. They want you to feel overloaded because they are gaining alliances to protest against you. Okay. Yeah, imagination. You're always on my mind. So somebody is looking at somebody like, somebody is looking elsewhere. They're looking at somebody that's more relaxed, more preserved. Okay, somebody that knows they were. Somebody that's standing in their power. Okay, somebody that actually is like a little lighter, lighter, a little lighter energy. Because whoever this other energy is, I'm picking up on a very dark energy. Okay, with this third wheel being the first chord, it's like the moon. Okay, this is why you are... Being called 10 is on top of this uh, court. So it's let me know. You completed out some cycles. This is why you're going through a powerful energy shift here. So like I said, you could be pulling your energy back from a lot of people. You could be isolating yourself at this time. Because you're like, man, I don't know what the fuck's going on. I'm trying to figure this shit out my own. Pray. Whoever you are, pray. I'm telling you, pray. Meditate. Okay, meditation brings answers. But like I said, somebody knows that you know. These alliances know that you know that they are working with the ops. Somebody's working with the ops. <laughs> That's what I deserve, yeah. I can't make this up. Ritual, right. You know somebody's working with the ops. You know somebody's doing something behind the scenes, okay? Because somebody was tempting somebody. Maybe somebody paid somebody. Somebody paid somebody to watch somebody. Somebody paid somebody to do something. Yeah, bully in reverse. Somebody paid somebody to fucking curse you. These people are learning today. They are learning, okay? They are learning. You're going to learn today. I don't know why the fuck I keep... You're going to learn today. Somebody's going to learn that nobody's more powerful than God here. Somebody was trying to scare you, okay? They were trying to make you have nightmares. That didn't work because you are okay with being alone. Okay, that's one thing people have failed to realize. When somebody is okay with being by themselves, it don't matter what the fuck you do to that person. That person's willpower, that person's strength from within. When somebody gets their strength from God, there is nothing that you can do. Yeah, illusion. It was all a dream. <laughs> it was all a fucking dream. Like I said, these people want to do attacks and shit and do shit in the spiritual realm. Uh, not understanding your ranking or who you are. Like, they, they don't even know the calling that, 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 that is on your life. When it comes to your profession, you're supposed to be mastering being by yourself. This is who you are. Somebody feel like you should be feeling like they are lost. You don't give a fuck about who this is because you know this person was always the enemy. This person was always competing with you. This was a karmic relationship. Yeah, and it was fate. It was fate. Somebody wanted to trap you. Somebody's like, no, your fate is to be trapped. Ready or not, here I come. You can't hide. Somebody wants to play victim too. They want to play victim because they know you have a better fortune than them. 
yeah, with dreaming, you are withdrawn for somebody. They know it's fate. You have faith. You're fated to be fortunate, to, to be very successful her you're fated okay and, and you the only way you'll be able to reach this fate is when you walk away from this i can't make this up justice when the moment when you withdraw is when you're going to receive justice so if you're going through something losing your finances okay over this marriage it's because this person i, I say this all the time be aware of smiling faces because you could be around somebody somebody just wants to use your energy because they're going through karma What's done in the light, what's done in the dark will come to the light, okay? Yeah, compromise. So something's coming to the light here. Somebody wants, they, somebody is trying their hardest for somebody to see their worth. Look at me, look at me, look at me, talk to me. What, 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 what am I, like, what? Somebody needs to find something to fucking do, like, really. Yeah, dominate, I'm telling you. This person is trying their hardest to dominate somebody's energy. Somebody wants somebody's attention so fucking bad. They are scared. They are so scared right now because somebody is like, nah, I'm good. I don't, I don't, I don't want to talk to no fucking body. Yeah, somebody's like, I don't want to talk to nobody, right? Nightmare. Somebody's like, bitch, you a nightmare. You, you, you bring nothing but darkness over my life. Every time you talk, every time you speak, somebody's like, nah, I'm going to keep praying, okay? I'm okay. I'm stable. I'm good. I'm going to stay where I'm at. Yeah, somebody's like, I'm already taking a bitch. Somebody could be about to take a trip. They're like, nah, I can't deal with this shit. I'm, not, I'm done with this shit. Somebody's leaving. They're like, I'm not doing this no more. Yeah, somebody's ready. Somebody's ready. But somebody feels like, oh, you sick. Bitch, you sick. Somebody, somebody feels like somebody is sick. Because somebody would not leave somebody alone. Like, yeah, somebody is literally praying her that somebody go away, okay? Because somebody's living and learning her. They're developing some skills. They're like, yeah, I'm getting away. Yeah, somebody's worried. They know you worry. They know why you worry. Somebody's like, yeah, I'm getting away. I know why the fuck you worry. I know what's going on. I know that you're doing shit behind the scenes. I know that you're mad. Yeah, illness in reverse. You're not ill. They want you to be ill. But you're relaxed. Somebody don't like it. They're like, nah, be disturbed like me. Yeah, wow. Because somebody, somebody wants you to overindulge, but you're not. You're making a promise to yourself, okay? You're making a promise to yourself. Yeah, because you know these people are protesting against you. So this person could be trying to sue you. Yeah, they're mad. They want to sue you. Somebody's like, I'm mad. I want to sue you so bad. Okay, somebody somebody wants everything that you got. They, they want to leave you with nothing. Whoever this is, they want to leave you with nothing. They're like, okay, you want to leave? You're going to have to leave with nothing. No. Somebody's making a promise. This is a confirmation for somebody as well. You're going to be stable. You're going to get good news. Just continue to know your worth, right? Spirit wants you to know. Continue to work, know your worth, okay? Don't, don't downgrade for nobody, okay? Yeah, because something's about to come on schedule for you. What did I say? Continue to know your worth. Self-love at the bottom of the deck. Continue to know your worth. This is why you're in the energy of breaking some type of curse. You're breaking some type of curse here on your life when it comes to karmic relationships. You're ending some type of cycles out right now. And I feel like <laughs> I've been picking up on a lot of energy with in and out cycles. But I feel like there's a lot coming out because there's a lot of new energy coming in. Okay, there's like some type of powerful eclipse here. Yeah. So somebody could be mad because somebody's pregnant her. Okay, somebody could be mad because somebody's pregnant or are they mad? They're mad because somebody, oh, this person, they, they know they worth or they're looking at somebody with the evil eye. Like in this picture, literally, this person is looking at this woman like, oh, they just hate the fact that this woman births ideas or this woman that is like, this woman's perfect. Somebody's looking at this woman like, damn, like, damn, yeah, enlightenment. Somebody's like, oh, they, they hate this about this woman though. They, somebody is really jealous. And this is why somebody is leaving. Yeah, vanity. Somebody's looking at somebody, trying to curse somebody. Like, ugh. Like, people need to quit worrying about other people. Like, somebody is so disgusted with, when it comes to somebody's creations. I'm telling you. Somebody hates the fact that this person is creative here. They don't like it. They don't like that. Now, I feel like you have somebody in your energy that is, like, attacking you because of somebody else and you can be in your own energy right divine masculine you could be stepping into your own energy breaking a generational curse like i said you could be isolating yourself releasing the stress releasing this worry and somebody is like trying to push it up on you like ready or not here i come you can't hide i'm telling you this person is very impatient this place person wants to find you like where are you at who are you with yeah you don't want me but but i don't care 
Somebody's like, I don't care. Yeah, you're enlightened to something and you're releasing somebody because you're rejecting somebody because you know what somebody's been doing. You know somebody's been doing something to stop your destiny. You know it. You, you can feel it. Yeah, mysticism. So sometimes something's very mysterious about your life. And somebody knows your destiny. They know your fortune. I can't make this up. Destiny pop right out. Somebody knows your destiny for greatness. So somebody continues to fuck with your free will. They continue to do this because they feel like they can, because they feel like they have some type of authority, because they feel like you've been with somebody, okay? You've been here, okay? You, you've, been some, you've been with somebody dealing with some shit for a very long time, and somebody really feels like they have some type of authority over your life. They feel like they know all your tricks. They know they know what you like. If somebody's going to try to play on your temptations, play on your friends and and all of this. I don't know who the fuck this is, but they 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 powerful enough to play play with you like that. They use people like this person is using different entities. Manifesting is my superpower, but understand who you do the fuck you are. Whoever you are, divine masculine, understand that you will have the power inside of you. You have superpowers too. See, this motherfucker fell to realize is you was a super motherfucking hero. When it comes to your own life, when it comes to breaking generational curses in your own life, okay? Give me one more card. Yeah, your sensitivity is a gift. So you being sensitive to this person and, and just being there. Like I said, this person is like, I'm a fan. You could still be trying to talk to this person like, yeah, man, I love you. But yeah, I just don't want to be with you. You're starting to trust your gifts here. You understanding that this person is like trying to create some type of turmoil mentally. And you're like, man, you know, I'm sensitive to your feelings. But right now, I just I don't I don't know what the fuck's going on because, you know, somebody is projecting some shit on you. Yeah, you clear your energy field. See this from a higher perspective. Like I said, you could be looking at something from a higher perspective. Like, man, I don't know. Yeah, I love you, but something got to go. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I am protected by source because you are understanding who you are. You not, you are understanding your, understanding your worth. Shift your perspective. I am the light in this world. Somebody wants you to feel like you know you you dark. You, you fucked up. You're going to leave me. You're going to leave me and I ain't got shit. That, that isn't your fault. Somebody was not worried about what comes with ending out a relationship that's what comes with personal fucking growth that what that that is what comes with personal growth see that's the problem divine counterparts they work together okay divine counterparts you know when you have somebody divine okay because you are working together in spirit until you get together and when you get together this is the whole point of twin flame journeys fall in love with yourself do shit for yourself because it's always some some type of karmic situation, some type of karmic lesson that we have to learn. We all have to learn our own fucking lessons. So this person wasn't learning their lesson. So, okay, now the, the, the wheel has turned. Okay, you're not in the spur. It's time for this person to learn their lesson. Quit fucking with people's free will. Quit trying to bind somebody and make somebody take care of you. That's not your destiny. Your destiny is not to take care of somebody you don't. You don't even want, like, you don't even want this person. Whoever you are, you are dumb with this person. You don't even want this person. You don't love this person like you used to. Yeah, loneliness. I know that I am not never alone. You know that you are never alone. But no, somebody doesn't have the courage to speak up and tell you, like, hey, you know, somebody's like, they're blaming you. Yeah, self-esteem. This person got low self-esteem. This person don't even love themselves. Like I said, this person is having problems loving themselves. Somebody's looking themselves in the mirror and they're like, they, they hate everything about they themselves. But that is not your fucking fault. You cannot love this person and, and show this person love and expect this person to treat you good. Or to uh, to say, no, this person is going to bring you down because this person, you, you have to learn to love yourself first. Indecision in reverse. This person is not using their intuition. They are in denial about you changing your conscious level. Like they're, they're, they're in denial about the way that you think because they feel like they have control over their mind. Somebody feels like, nah, we always do it. You're going to come back. You're like, no, I'm not fucking coming back. I'm gone. Relationships. I'm attracted to those people who serve my highest good. Somebody fears that you, you're going to find somebody better. And you are. You will. Why is relationship hurt? Success. I can't make this up. I know that there is no greater go than to love. So somebody feels like a failure. Oh, if you go that way, I'm going to feel some type of way. No, you're healing. This 
person is worried about all the wrong things. This person was not worried about what they were going to do without you. This person depends on man. This person don't depend on God. This person is not. This person is not okay of oh God. Okay, I'm getting. I'm picking up on a real, real fearful energy. Like this woman is very insecure of herself. She's very fearful of being alone. Somebody just like has to have somebody to validate them. Like somebody feels like if you leave, they're gonna lose their credibility when it comes to their throne. Like you don't even have a throne. Who the fuck gave you your crown, Ma? Steve Harvey? You don't even have a throne. You don't even have a legacy. You're not even working for nothing. You don't even want to work for nothing. You're not building anything with somebody. You you literally wanted to take somebody, curse somebody, and take their finances, take everything, and you didn't get nothing, bitch. Yeah, judgment. I can't make this shit up. I understand that everyone has their own unique paths and challenges. So this person is under judgment. Yeah, because you're set free. <laughs> you set free here. You're at peace. I'm a being of love, and I release all negative energy. So you're releasing this energy. So now this person's scared because they see that you're not even trying to fight with me. You're not even trying to fight with me. I'm hurting. You're not even trying to fight with me. Somebody is constantly trying to get a reaction out of you. And you like, whoever you are, Divine Masculine, you are literally, I'm talking to a Divine Masculine. You are literally cutting this witch off. You like, nah, witch. You like, nah, you, you something ain't right. Yeah, service. I feel good when I can help others. Yeah, purpose. You know something ain't right. You can feel it. You can feel that something's not right. Yeah, change and reverse. This, you, you, you can feel this person. Like, you, you don't want to change. Somebody is realizing this. Okay, you are realizing. You're using your discernment that, hey, this person is not trying to change. Yeah, failure. I understand that a mistake is only an opportunity to learn. But you can stand up and be a man and learn from your mistakes, but this bitch can't. Yeah, this bitch can't change. Because, no, she, she wants you to. She wants you to force. Somebody really wants you to force yourself on them. Like, somebody wants you to be so mad. Like, I don't get this. I don't get this. So, I'm picking up on the energy. Somebody is really trying to get a reaction out of you to get you fucked up. They want you fucked up. They want you in jail. Yeah, conception and consciousness. They want you fucked up mentally. They want you fucked up physically where you can't work, where you can't do nothing for yourself. So nobody wants you. Yeah, humor. I choose to focus on the lighter side of life. But no, you're free. Okay, you're free to step into your purpose here. This is what you're being called to do. Yeah, belief. To change your beliefs. Okay, somebody was very impatient when it comes to doing this magic because this magic is reversing. It's backfiring her. Okay, we have doubt in reverse. You're not doubting yourself. You're not doubting your gifts. You're releasing. You're, you're, you're surrendering something. You're like, nah, I know what you've been doing, okay? My nose is in shit, that's confirmation. You know what you, somebody's been doing under your fucking nose. Yeah, authority, love, because somebody knows that somebody loves you, okay? Somebody knows that somebody has authority here, freedom, earth, yeah. You're free, divine masculine, and somebody's worried. They're worried about you being happy, Getting the uh, desires that you believe. Getting somebody that's on your level. Yeah, adversity. I accept the challenges are the best way to learn. Like I said, somebody is very jealous of a divine film. They are just jealous of a divine film here. Who is birthing something, okay? When it comes to abundance, somebody is very abundant, okay? In the spirit. And somebody is jealous. They fear this. They fear you having a divine union with somebody. Yeah, grieving. They're grieving. They're crying. They're crying over this divine film. I can't make this up. They crying over this divine film. This woman is so focused on somebody else. When you're, whoever you are, you're going through an ascension, right? And you can know that you have a divine film. But this person is so focused on you creating something with someone. Yeah, solar plex chakra. Somebody really, really wants to use your... Be careful having sex with this person. Somebody uses your sexual energy, okay? This is a part of their, some magic that they do, divine masculine, okay? Solar plex, where they play on your solar plex. They play on that chakra. Yeah, abundance. This is how somebody creates abundance from you. Somebody feels like if you go towards this divine film, you're going to create this abundance, okay? You're going to manifest something. You're going to be happy. 
Somebody doesn't want you to do that. Yeah, empathy. I am open to seeing both sides of the situation. But you're looking at both sides of the situation like, okay, you understand that somebody's inferred why somebody else is sitting in gratitude, attitude of gratitude. Somebody is thankful. Yeah, free. Somebody wants to blame you for being free. They're like, no, you can't be free. You can't set yourself free from me. Somebody really wants you to fur leaving them. Like, what? Yeah, allowance in reverse. They do not want to allow you. They don't feel like you should be allowed to do anything. They feel like you should be stuck to them. Yeah, pride. I love myself and see myself in everyone. Yeah, we have earth in reverse communication. So, yeah, somebody wants to communicate something to her. But I feel like, um, yeah, somebody is just not disciplined. They're not disciplined. They're, they're falling short when it comes to their home situation, right? You could be changing something when it comes to just being thankful for what you have because you're realizing like, hey, this person is fucking bitter as fuck. You're like, nah, man. Divine masculine, I can't make this up. You're ending something because you're like, nah, man, I got to focus on my health. Somebody's like, I'm getting too old for this shit. I need some passion in my life. I need something, something that's going to motivate me to thrive, to be better. Yeah, growth. Somebody don't want you to grow. I want to expand my consciousness and my awareness. Yeah, third eye chakra. And this masculine is awakening, okay? Somebody else is in denial. They fear a friend. They envy you. There's a friend that envies you getting what you deserve to. Yeah, worry. That's, that's in cahoots with this ex, okay? Somebody's in cahoots with somebody. Somebody's doing something with someone behind the scenes. Or clarify, give me one. I can't make this up. Devil energy. You're a master. You're mastering yourself, okay? You're breaking some type of generational curse. What I say, devil energy is past lover. So continue to worship. Get off of that, everyone. Thank you. Yeah, 432. You could be listening to some uh, meditation music. We have older female paying for sex. I'm telling you, this woman could even be having sex with your friend. I just heard. This woman is very desperate. Yeah, old habits. Somebody is just, I got way too many bad habits. I keep in on my love life. I keep messing on my love life. Yeah, I keep seeing you everywhere. But you keep seeing somebody, right? And this person is just constantly watching you. But this person is doing all type of shit behind the scenes, okay? Like I said, you could be focused on your health, being called to eat healthy here. Yeah, and take a leap of faith when it comes to some type of royal royal situation here know that you are royalty yeah watch your back i'm telling you there's somebody you know close that back door don't let that person in yeah and continue to be you yeah because you're a hero what the fuck did i say this person is mad because you're a hero and somebody i know you guys to talk i'm telling you this person is mad because of a divine film because something was enlightened in your energy that you went through a rebirth rebirth and this person's boat is sinking i'm telling you and you're calling in some type of support somebody is furious giving and receiving god deeper demonic spirits i'm telling you this person is sending people literally to watch you okay but understand you are powerful you could be having some type of vision maybe this is why you're pulling your energy back because you're having some type of vision about something you like yeah okay yeah your crown chakra is being awakened so you're understanding something here. Mm, Yeah, somebody's feeling helpless. Okay, this could be family. Okay, somebody's feeling helpless, sir. They really want they really want you to feel the way they feel, but I feel like this energy is not even hitting you. Okay, we have Gemini out here stealing. Yeah, somebody's stealing. Somebody wants to steal. Somebody wants to take from you. Yeah, wrong use of power. Give me one. Need to seek help. Yeah, this person definitely needs to seek help. But you can upgrades and downloads her. We have Taurus here. Yeah, not focused karmic lesson. I'm telling you, somebody just need to understand this was a karmic lesson. Somebody lacks a lot of knowledge. Okay, this person's chakras is blocked. Okay, and a real divine, uh, divine feminine does not is not out here paying for sex. Somebody's paying for sex. It's something about your dreams here. Yeah, you're getting good karma because you always have pure intentions. This is why you have power because you're blessed because you're doing something alone. You're like, I'm doing it alone. How can I have, why would I be in despair? Why would I be sad? Why would I be with you? And I could be by my motherfucking self, bitch, and be happy. Because I got the power. You took your fucking power back from this witch-ass bitch. Yeah, you're going through bad karma. That's what you get. What you see is what you get. Yeah, somebody's worried. Because they know. They have a mental attention behind this shit. 
Right game, wrong nigga. That's what the fuck I just heard. Right game, wrong wrong nigga. Right game, wrong bitch. Whoever you are, divine fib, divine masculine. Somebody's waging heavy ass war on your clown chakra here. Okay, you could be a writer. Okay, Spurs said keep going. Yeah, this person needs to seek help because somebody's just worried about material shit. But how are you worried about material shit when you paying for sex? This bitch is trucking with other motherfuckers and, and need your help to, to pay for it. What? Jail arrested. Somebody's going to get arrested for trying to steal something from you. So somebody can try to play these games if they want to and do it magic if they want to and use people and all of that. The shit's going to go right back. And I'm telling you, it's going to go back tenfold. Whatever somebody's trying to do behind the scenes, it's going to keep backfiring on somebody because somebody is just untouchable, unfuckwittable. Whoever you are, I'm talking to a powerful motherfucker. And somebody needs to understand that you are too powerful. Like, God placed you in this power for a reason. Okay, God gave you this, this knowledge for a reason. Because he knew you wouldn't abuse it. So now that you know who your enemies are, God wants you to understand that, hey, you have to go through this powerful transformation and release the, these energies here. Give me one for it. So it's true. Okay, we have, how can I be more kind to myself and offer more grace in this very moment? Growing our self-love is medicine to this world's broken heart. When you heal, we all heal. When you give yourself more grace, you are able to give the world more grace. Look at yourself with a grace glitter. You are meant to be in this moment of your life. Release the inner critic and fill in that hole with your soul's truth. That you are infinite and you are loved and you are already there. So yeah, you guys... Quit being so hard on yourself because this person is projecting a lot of energy. So release this judgment. Okay, we have from whom can I release my judgment right now? Judgment closes our heart to truth and separates us from love. It binds us to our fear and holds us in shame. On whom are you placing judgment right now? Is it someone in your life? Is it yourself? Release the shackles, drop the expectations, and be grateful for what is. Look at that person you are judging as if you are looking at a small child. See them learning and growing, falling down and making mistakes. See their desire to be loved and accepted. Add even more grace to open up your heart to this truth. When I lift the judgment from myself and others, I uncover my own truth. I am loved. I am whole. I am limitless. And so are they. I feel like that with this card, you guys, you're being called to release some type of expectation when it comes to the truth. Okay? You know, truth is, if you was good to this person, it's okay to release this person. I feel like this person is very childish, okay? So somebody, I feel like you're being called, Spirit said, look at this person as a child, okay? Understand that somebody could have a lot of freaking issues, you know what I'm saying? Childhood traumas, and it, it's okay. We're not beating nobody up about it, but somebody really has to grow up and learn from the situation, and if it takes for you to walk away, you have to take your pacifier, this pacifier at this woman's mouth, because this woman's not going to stop sucking on that motherfucker, okay? If you give this motherfucker a pacifier, keep sucking, she's going to keep sucking, 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 and, and, and uh, somebody needs to take the pacifier from this woman, okay? Anything else that I want to pull from you? all? Oh, angel numbers, okay. Yeah, because somebody acts like a big-ass kid, and it's time to, you know, look at the situation for what it is, and that's the truth. Yeah, 27, your mind is wide open, and you are tolerant and compassionate towards all ways of life. You value freedom of expression and want to improve the conditions of people, whether in your community, country, or at the world at large. I am expressive. Then you have to express yourself. I am expressive. So some of you guys are really expressive. So express yourself in whatever way. Express yourself. <laughs> We have 666, a wake-up call for you to re-examine your current situation and change the direction of your thoughts so you can raise your vibration to a more positive frequency. I am center. Yes, somebody wants you to be in the energy of worry. This is what somebody's projecting. But 777, your purpose flows from within you and everything that is unfolding are being revealed to you as part of your purpose. A state of peace and calmness in your soul. I am in flow. So, yeah, you guys are in flow with something. So, you know, continue to rise up, Okay. And continue to, you know, rebuke these people that are trying to be in your energy to try to siphon your energy. Because somebody is really just in the devil energy, okay? So, just continue to break these curses. And, you know, you guys stay prayed up. That's all I got for you. Love and light. Namaste. I'll shake.